Yesterday, the energy regulator warned that there could be blackouts over this winter. That's something you said in the leadership campaign you would not uh, let happen. Um, are you contemplating defying your Chancellor and buying many years of Norwegian gas at close to current prices in order to secure supply? Well, what I have said is, first of all, we will move forward on our own energy security. So that's more renewables here in the UK, it's more nuclear power here in the UK, and it's also moving forward faster with using North Sea facilities. But we are looking at long-term energy contracts with other countries because as well as making sure we've got a good price, energy security is vitally important. And we never want to be in a position again where we're dependent on authoritarian regimes for our energy. That's why we're in the situation we are now. That's why many European countries are in the situation we are now. And that's why we're determined that we become more energy independent. Hang on, so you're planning to spend, to borrow, to buy years' worth of gas, increasing borrowing, increasing the deficit at almost record high prices, and you think that's a good deal? Well, I've not signed any deal, but what I'm but saying is well, what I'm saying is that Britain's energy security oh. is vital and what we will be doing is always looking for value for money. Of course we will, but it's important that we have that long term energy security and what's happened in the past is we've ended up being dependent on the global spot price. And we've seen the effect of that. We've seen the fact that people are facing bills of £6,000. And I never want Britain to be in that position again. You, you, you think the market's be happy with maybe tens, if not hundreds of billions of pounds well, this more is, borrowing? This is speculation. You know, no, no deal had been signed. But as I'm very clear about, we're completely focused on fiscal discipline. We will be bringing down the debt as a proportion of GDP over the medium term, but making sure we've got energy security is clearly vital for our country.